Mm -hmm. Just so we know, did the crime happen in Brynn, Washington, and that's why I'm not allowed to go there? I haven't been there for 15 years. I haven't been to Quilcene mm -hmm. or uh, Brynn, Washington, yeah, for since 2000, maybe. Could have been in 2009, but I know it wasn't in the last 10 years. Yeah. Now, what's to say, yeah, that you admit the evidence? Now, your thought of covering up your crime, of accusing me of a crime because of a criminal complaint, was that if you can prove that I am mentally incompetent, yes, you can get away with crime. Oh. The problem is I just emailed you the evidence that I wasn't there. Now, what is the issue with sheriffs, police departments, and judiciaries thinking that they will not go to prison for treason? Mm. Now, let's look at it for a second. Let's say you're at home. Mm -hmm. You have a large number of tropical fish. Yeah. Usually they're very expensive. Yeah. Could you get me all the tropical fish stores where a fish costs more than a dollar? <laughs> See, fish are attracted to fish as much as you dislike the idea they're big on aquariums. Yes. And the more expensive fish that they can purchase, the wealthier they feel. <laughs> now, I'm just going to need to know how much you've been spending on fish. Yes. So get me all the tropical fish stores, yes, and all the employees of the tropical fish stores, yes, where you as oaths, badges, and attorneys mm, would not think it weird to spend $500 to $1,000 for a fish because of your... <laughs> now I'm going to need to know the employees uh -huh. of every retail outlet where you can buy a fish because it seems that some very exotic tropical fish, yes, that happened to be dogged, yes, thought that they were so wealthy they could buy them where you are. Now, I know. Vice President Pence has a large aquarium in one of his residences because he has more than one residence. <laughs> and he studies the DNA, doesn't he, Vice President? Now, the Vice President and the Cabinet, yes, could you call Rex Tillerson, Exxon, and then there's Mike Pompeo, the former director of the Central Intelligence Agency. Yes. Steve Munchen. Yes. United States Treasury Department. <laughs> James Mattis and Jeff Sessions. Jeff Sessions is no longer <laughs> the Attorney General of the United States of America. <laughs> then there's Ryan Zinke, <laughs> Sonny Purdue. Yeah. Wilbur Ross. Yeah. Alexander Acosta. <laughs> Tom Price and Alex Azor. <laughs> now, for everyone in the president's cabinet, inclusive of the vice president, mm, you have any knowledge of this treason, I'll put you in fucking prison right now. <laughs> now... You say I can't. I say I can. Mm -hmm. I'm scheduled for a cell hearing tomorrow. Yes. Where the whole county's trying to cover up their corruption by having me admitted to a mental facility. Yes. So they can involuntarily administer psychotropic medication against my will when the whole county has the evidence that I wasn't in Brennan and I wasn't cyber stalking. That for sure is treason. Now, you get me the presidential cabinet, yes, of the last 40 years of administrations of the White House. Because I'll put every fucking vice president right now, Pence, you piece of shit. Why don't you give me the tropical bitch of every cabinet member of the White House? <laughs>